explain? How do I explain this? I can't reveal myself. Hi, this is, oh my god, I'm not supposed to tell you who I am. So, we're going to play a little game. I'm going to start revealing a little thing about myself. And um, let's see if by the time a few questions are over, you can guess who I am or if in case you already don't know. Okay, um, Nisha, who's hot and why? Who's hot? Mm, that would be Robert Redford. And why? Because he is a classic. He was, He's a man who a woman can want to have even today after 20 years of changes in whatever we perceive men should be in today's time. Okay, who's, who's not hot am I? <gasps> oh my god, I can't say that now. Just because I find Robert Redford hot doesn't mean I've got to say who's not. Well, um, compared to Robert Redford, well, there will be a lot of people who are not hot, but let's not comment on that. Okay, who's sexy and why? Sexy Sam, obviously, and I don't need to say why. Who's boring? You know, my friends call me boring because come Saturday night and I disappear, I refuse to party. Uh, come Friday night and I'm already ducking and waiting for excuse, you know, making up excuses about why I can't party. So most of the time I've ended up being called boring. So, well, there you go, it's me. Who's scary and why? Who is scary? Mm. No one that I know till now, unfortunately. Okay, who's hairy and I? My dog, Misty. She's this cute little Tibetan terrier who is the most hairiest thing I've seen. She's white and when she's in snow, she merges in with the snow and the only thing you can, the only way you can make out where she is is by her two black eyes and her one black little nose sticking out in between the snow. Okay, Now can you guess who I am? Who is she, uh, who you would love to get to know? Brad Pitt, definitely. Who you love to date? Love? Can't tell you that, actually. <laughs> but Brad Pitt. Who you would love to marry? Who I'd love to marry? Person who I'd probably fall in love with. That hasn't happened as yet, so let's wait and watch. When I know, you'll know. Okay, uh, what made you become an actor? Um, acting is something that happened by fluke. I'd never actually consciously decided that acting was something I wanted to do. Um, I was doing a bit of modeling along with the college in New Delhi and one of the ads that I did was uh, for Sujit Sarkar, this Cadbury commercial. And right there and there he said, look, I'm making a film, it's based on Kashmir and uh, I think you fit the role. I thought about it for two, three months because acting was something I'd never thought of. I actually originally wanted to be a war journalist. So I thought about it for a bit and uh, you know, my parents helped me a lot, they were extremely supportive and we decided, okay, fine, you know, I just have six months to graduate, let's just, um, maybe this is what my future is, let's see. Okay, uh, were you disappointed when Yaha really didn't do that, although it was very good, but were you disappointed? Uh, you know what has happened, if Yaha had released now, it would have got much better commercial success simply because um, Yaha unfortunately was perceived as a non-commercial film, which it wasn't. Um, it was a great storyline, it was above all else a love story entwined in, in a turmoil-based area called Kashmir. It was, ended up being a film that, it was a strong love story which uh, also touched upon the topic of Kashmir about why the place is the way it is today. Uh, so unfortunately that was perceived as uh, a non-commercial subject by people but whoever saw it loved the film, it touched their heart, it was a love story that um, I fell in love with after a long time and um, it did very well, it was recognized by people as a good film and ultimately that's what I as an artist endeavor to be. It was a good film, a great story and a great director and I wish that I get more films like Yaha which make you think, which make you feel that yes, cinema is touching lives, is touching issues that we really encounter in life and bringing them to the fore. Uh, what are you excited about? 
Um, well, I'm excited about a film of mine called Honeymoon Travels Private Limited, which will be releasing uh, in 2007, and another film of mine called Anamika, which will be releasing then as well. So that's what's on store right now. I have another uh, brand of mine that is going to be launched called Neutrogena, so excited about that. Um, but more in the months to come ahead, I'll have lots more to tell you about what 2007 brings. And uh, that's good. 2006 has been great, and here's hoping that 2007 is even bigger and better. Uh, my future as an actress, well, everyone um, endeavors that whatever you do in life is something that you would grow in, something that you would be better at as time goes on. And that is what I am endeavoring to do myself, to be a better actress, a better performer, um, better uh, as an artist from what I was in 2006 to grow more and um, hoping that life has lots more to offer and that I have a lot more to offer my fans in the coming year. Hi, this is Manisha Lamba. Don't go anywhere and be new to people.